Hello? I would like to speak to Bone Quisha. Otis? Yes, this is Otis. She don't want to talk to you. Well, tell her she is going to hear me one way or the other. Either she steps outside or either she's going to hear me through the door. You know, Bone Quisha, ever since you and I stopped seeing each other, I ain't been doing nothing but thinking, thinking, thinking. I ain't been able to sleep. I ain't been able to do nothing that required you being in it. Baby, I know that we've had rough times before, but we got through it. Like the time all the power went off in the house and we had to finish cooking the collard greens on the half heater, but we did it together. All the time that the froster didn't work on the microwave and the turkey was still frozen, remember we had to get chicken down from Larry's Long Neck Leg Quarter Late Night Chicken House. Remember? But now I don't have you and that's why I'm having these Christmas blues. Yes, Christmas blues. Sometimes I wonder, was it worth it? Waking up early in the morning to go to the little champ to get you three pickle eggs, some Lay's plain potato chips, and a Coca-Cola. I said, self, was it worth it? And myself answered back, yes, it was real worth it. I miss you, and I love you so much. I'll do anything to make you mine again. I'm all so lonely, so, so sad and blue. I'm spending Christmas Day without you. I'm very, very sad and lonely. But anyway, let me tell you something. I do have you and the kids a present this year. I had y'all a present last year, but you know, my alternator broke in my truck, and you know, I need my truck for the, um, for the go to work. And so, I had to take the receipt, take all the presents back, and fix my alternator. But I do got you a present this year. I didn't have time to wrap it up. I got in some brown, Pick and save bags. Also, I got some wine. I got some cold duck, baby. You need to open the door. He quacking. I remember one Christmas, maybe three Christmases ago, we ran out of ham, and you said you wanted another ham. But you really didn't say you wanted another ham. I just figured that's what you wanted. So they had a, a 12 dozen crab special, so I got you a dozen of big blue crabs. I mean, I'm just saying, I just hope this Christmas is a little different. You know, I just want a little turkey, a little that sweet, sweet plum dressing. Um, you know, I just want the kids to be happy. And you know, I... Bone Quisha, I know when we got married, I vowed to give you diamonds and pearls. But when I hurt my back at work, my workman's comp could only get zirconia and gander necklaces. I also said that when we moved out of your mama's house, we were going to move into a place double her size. That's why I got two trailers and put them together. Yes, baby, double wide. All those things I done for you and the kids, but I still have these Christmas blues because I'm spending Christmas out the kids and you. I love you, Bunquisha, I love you. But you know what, one thing I want to tell you this year about Christmas, last year when you served up all the turkey and, every, and you know, all the, all of the trimmings and everything, when the cranberry dressing got round to me, there was none left. So please, could you, I, well I hope you have two cans of cranberry dressing in there because I love that cranberry sauce. Please, thank you, and please open the door, baby, it's cold.